Hi guys, just a quick one. Um, Luke and I were talking after the Ace Labs conference when they introduced the T2 file to us, uh, and uh, we noticed that there's uh, a zero data area. So we can see, for instance, from this drive, uh, only about 14% of the drive is actually being used. Um, and we said, well, I wondered if we could use that as a, a use sectors bitmap at some point, uh, if you can't see the bitmap on the drive. Um, and we suggested it to Ace and maybe they will have that built into um, DE at some point in the future. But I just happen to have a drive uh, where you can actually use it, this as a bitmap. Um, this is, when you, you build the heads on a on a, a Spyglass 2 drive or, or at least a drive that uses T2, if you notice the head map builds really quickly um, because it only has to actually record which sectors are under which head and it only records uh, the sectors that have data so you can see here this detail said eight and there's data uh, we can scan down head five head zero head three now where there's no data on the drive it won't actually give you a head at all because it's not bothered to record it because it knows there's no data so therefore we can use that as a bitmap. Um, I've already imaged this drive, so uh, I'll have to select a few. So this is basically this is basically all the sectors on the drive. And if we then select uh, create submap using heads only, because the heads have only recorded where there's data, this is actually the bitmap of the drive. Uh, anyway, so. If you have a T2 and you can't read the file table or you can't read the bitmap, then, then you can use T2 to maybe image some data. So anyway, hope that helps you.